Welcome to the chapter Food Habits. This slide presents the overview of the chapter. Learning Objectives By the end of this chapter, you will be able to Recognize the food habits of people living in different regions. Explain the food habits of different animals. Infer the importance of eating food together. Explain how the food habits change according to age. List the good food habits. Now, let us start our chapter with the introduction. In previous classes, we learned that all living beings need food. Food provides us energy for doing different activities and helps us to grow. The food we eat is obtained from plants and animals. All the food items are not cooked in the same way. The method of cooking would be different for different food items. Leafy and non-leafy vegetables should be washed thoroughly before cooking. Do you know what are the food habits of people living in different parts of the country? What are the food habits of animals? What is the importance of eating food together? Why do food habits change according to age? What are the good food habits? Let us try to answer these questions and learn more about the food habits of humans and animals. All the school children went on a picnic to the zoo in Hyderabad during Dasara holidays. They made friendship with the other school children who came there from different places. They started watching the animals in the zoo. It had become afternoon. All the children and teachers gathered at a place and started eating the food brought from their homes. Let us know what they are eating. Hi, I am Shreya. I am from Kannul. I am eating rotis made with millets. Millets are mostly grown in our village. So most of our villagers eat rotis in the morning and at night. Hi, I am Rakesh. I am from Nellur. I am eating rice with fish curry. Most of the people in our village eat fish and prawns only because the seashore is close to our village. Hi, I am Priya. I am from Gudivada. I am eating rice. Most of the people in our village eat rice because paddy is largely grown in our village. Hi, I am Dikshit. I belong to Mahbubnagar. I am drinking Ambali. Ragi Mat is mostly grown in our village. All our family members like Ambali. Here, let us study the food habits of different people living in different parts of the country. Generally, people live in different regions will have different food habits. For example, people living in hilly regions and in the forests of Telangana eat different roots, fruits, etc. available in their region. Their food habits depend on the type of crops grown and available in their region. Similarly, the people in Rajasthan eat rotis made of jowar or jonna because jowar is mostly grown in Rajasthan. People in Delhi, Gujarat and Madhya Pradesh eat rotis and puri. People in Telangana, Andhra Pradesh, Tamil Nadu and Karnataka eat rice. Whereas the people in Kerala eat more fish along with rice. Different varieties of food items are cooked and eaten on different occasions like marriages, festivals, local faves, birthdays, etc. Knowledge Check Attempt the following questions to check your understanding.
After meals, all the students started watching the animals. Ali, look at the giraffe. How tall it is. Oh God, really Rohan, it is very tall. Priya, look at those pigeons. They are eating grains. Yes, Lata, all pigeons have gathered at once and are eating. Hey, Karthik, watch those tigers. How they are fighting? Oh God, they are looking dangerous. Hey, Lata, watch those elephants. They are eating something. Yes, Ali, they are eating both plantains and sugar cane at the same time. Animals and birds need food like us. Different animals and birds have different food habits. They eat different food like grains, meat, plants, milk, etc. Look at the pictures and match them correctly according to the food they eat. Let us know the importance of eating food together. All the members of the family should eat together. Eating food together helps in the distribution of food items equally among the members. We feel happy when we eat together. Generally, during festivals, birthday parties and marriages, all the people, including elders and children, sit together and eat. This indicates the value that all are one and equal. Here, let us study how the food habits change according to age. In this way, food habits change according to age. Lokesh brought sweet corn or mokajonna kanki while returning home from school. After reaching home, he tried to feed it to his little sister who was in the cradle. Mother declined his offer and said that the baby was an infant and she could not eat it. Then he rushed to his grandpa and asked him to have the corn. He also refused, saying that he could not eat it. Infants don't have teeth, so they cannot chew the food. Hence, they are given either milk or soft food. In the same way, old people also lose their teeth and they cannot chew the food. They also eat soft food. In this way, food habits change according to age. Let us study the good food habits that ought to be followed by everyone. Always eat good food. In the same way, we should have good food habits. Always wash hands and legs with soap before and after eating. We should clean the floor after eating. Knowledge Check Attempt the following questions to check your understanding. Keywords. List of keywords are shown on the screen. Summary. Let us recap the highlights of this chapter. People living in different regions will have different food habits. Food habits of a region depend on the type of crops grown and the availability of food items in that region. People in Telangana, Andhra Pradesh, Tamil Nadu and Karnataka eat rice. Different varieties of food items are cooked and eaten on different occasions like marriages, festivals, local faves, birthdays, etc. Animals and birds need food like us. Different animals and birds have different food habits. Eating food together helps in the distribution of food items equally among the members. Food habits change according to age. We should have good food habits. Always wash hands and legs with soap before and after eating. 
Read the questions and attempt the answers on your own. You can click answer for your reference. Follow up work. Take up the following activities. Fill in the table with the food items that are eaten on various occasions. Why some of the food items cannot be eaten by the infants and the old people? Ask your elders and know what items old people can eat. What food items infants can eat? Fill the table with the particulars. Observe the pictures given below. Draw them. Write about them. Ask any five of your friends and know about the times they eat together at their homes. Take at the proper place. In whose houses are people eating together for more number of times? When do they eat together and on what occasions? Test your understanding of the chapter by taking the mock unit test. You have successfully completed the chapter Food Habits.